All the NFL Network does now is talk about, they have nothing to talk about, except guys who get arrested. So it's just like police stuff. It's like this guy got arrested for beating up some girl in a bar. Michael Vick shot somebody again, supposedly. Then this guy, Brian Cushing, is like got caught from steroids. This is all they talk about. It's really depressing. Like, I want to watch some NFL, and it's just like, this guy got arrested, this guy got DWI, this guy fucked his car up. It's fucking ridiculous. You know? You just turn the channel off until the season starts. You know? And guys also holding out, like, making like $100 million, like, sitting out at the uh, spring training on preseason. Pizza! Pizza the Hut! Remember that movie? This is North End, which the guy's from Boston, which uh, I don't know, we'll see. There was a, I, I, I know a good Boston pizza place called uh, Anthony's, I think. It's an Italian name. Papa John's. Papa Gino's. Pizzeria. Whose dog is that? It's, it's like perfectly grilled. Ah. You know anything about LeBron James? It's crazy too. I gotta get status like that. I like you just go in the meetings and they just wine and dine you and like you can have you can own a fucking team if you play your cards right. I mean, it's like every, but like sometimes you go to meetings and like you're worried if they're gonna like you, or like they would let them fuck the receptionist, if you, you know. I mean, it's crazy. It's very hard because this is like the most amazing moral dilemma in your life. Because he knows deep, he's a good guy. So deep down, he should probably stay home because he's like a, a local hero. But who the fuck? Wants to, to be in Cleveland when you can be in like Miami or New York or Los Angeles or Chicago, like some beautiful cities, the best food. But like you're obligated to stay in like shithole Cleveland, and and like he's also from Akron, which is like an hour away from Cleveland, which is probably the armpit of America. So it's like this awful like, you know, what do I do? I mean, everybody wants to go somewhere else. I don't know. If I were him, I'd go to probably New York or Chicago. People will forgive him. My boy D. Wade, though, called me the other day, asked what I should do. Nah, joke. Everybody in New York, I always tell them because they think they're going to get him. I'm like, yeah, I talked to him. I told him that not to come to New York. And they believe me. Because I know I did a commercial with him. So I'm like, hey, I talked to Dwayne Wade. I said, don't come to New York. It sucks. And they're like, how dare you? This pizza's not so bad. Best pizza in New York, Carmine's Pizza and, and uh, Williamsburg, Brooklyn, 358 Graham Avenue. What's up, Carmine? Troy, the tomato pie is pretty good. This isn't bad, but it's not. Tomato pie is the best so far. Uh, I've been to a few places people say it's really good and they haven't really lived up to. Little Dobbs makes a hell of a chicken parm. 